Hey y'all, thanks for stopping by. Um, I have these car coasters and there's a story behind this. Um, as you can see, well, first of all, they're, I don't know if you can see or not, but they're etched on top. Um, both of them are. So these, that's the front and then this is the back. Um, it's gold mica powder with gold um, holographic glitter in it. And the story behind this is um, disappointing because I made a set of dominoes, um, finished them, they look gorgeous. Um, I found a box that I also, um, I didn't find a box, I found a, a silicone mold to make a box to put the dominoes in. And after I got finished with it, um, and put the top back, or put the top on the box, the top just sits on the box. It doesn't connect it doesn't have hinges or it doesn't have like a little lip around the edge. Anyway, I was disappointed about that. And then I go to edit the video because it was, it was kind of long. It was almost an hour long. And um, due to technical difficulties that I was having, I lost the whole entire video. So, um, yeah, it wasn't going to be an hour long, um, you know, when I, when I released it to YouTube, um, you know, I had to go in and, and do some editing work and, and stuff like that, but I still have the dominoes and I still have the box. So, um, I did find another mold, um, that do the dominoes will fit in. And I'm waiting on that. So that's, to make a long story longer, yeah, that's what happened. But um, the resin that I had left over, I thought, ooh, I'll just go ahead and pour it in my car coaster molds. And it was the perfect amount. So um, I was going to do the tops of these in black. And then I thought, no, um, let's do them in blue because blue looks really pretty with um, gold. So what I'm going to do is I'm shaking up my bottle real good. Now this is this was um, a liquid acrylic paint. It's kind of in between like really liquid and a medium body. But it's uh, Deco Art Metallic. Um, what is what is this color? They put it in all these different languages. It's ice blue. It's a real pretty color. So here's here's my resin, which I'll show you guys next. Oh. And then I'm just gonna pour this on my little candy dandy. I don't know if y'all can see this or not. A little handy dandy little lid here. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my paint and I'm just gonna paint the top of this. You don't have to be really neat, nice and neat and tidy about it. Just make sure you don't get it on the sides because you'll have to just wipe it off when you wipe off the top. So, you know, you want to look at it. Make sure you have all of those little lines in here. And you'll see, you'll see what I'm talking about here in a minute. Um, just look and see if all of the lines are filled in. Because if not, you're going to have to go over it again. Okay, and I think this looks about right. So, after you get it all 
painted. Then what you want to do is take a paper towel and just wipe it off. I don't know if that blue is going to be dark enough or not. Oh well. I might have to do them, come back and do them in black. Or just put them in my car. <laughs> I don't know yet. But, um, yeah, you just want to come along and wipe the paint off. Or wipe off as much as you can. And there you go. You've got your your um, etching. I call it etching. I guess it's etching. Um, I've got paint. That's the story of my life. I just I'm not. I cannot be neat and tidy. <laughs> okay. That looks about right. Okay, so we're going to do the other one. Let me get some paper towel here. I always keep paper towel handy um, when I'm working with resin. And that's another um, side note that I want to let you guys know. Is that when you're working with resin and you're... You know, if you're like me, your your gloves get all sticky and nasty, um, and you have to handle your heat gun, or maybe you're using a torch, um, get you some baby wipes and just wipe off your hands. Um, when you're using, like I use these um, plastic, um, what do you call them, sticks, I guess, stirs, whatever. Um, I use the bottom part to uh, stir uh, my colors inside my resins and when you get done um, Your project is over. You're not going to use it anymore Take your baby wipe and just wipe it off and you're good to go for the next time Okay Tip of the day all right So It's hard to see Okay, so we're gonna it doesn't matter which way, you can do it this way, you can do it, you know, you can do it all different ways. And it doesn't take very much, because I'm going to scoop as much as I can. Uh, I'm going to scoop this paint and put it back in the bottle, because I've squirted out too much paint. Okay. Make sure you kind of want to, um, you know, press down a little bit hard because you do want, you know, these lines are so fine or thin, however you want to call call them. Um, they're so thin that you really want to make sure that you get that paint in there. So you kind of want to go down really, you know, not like, but you do want to press down kind of hard. Okay. Alrighty. We are done with that. Put that aside. Okay. Now you want to wipe it off. Let's see if there's an easier way of doing it. Okay, and kind of make sure that you don't have like any residue or little little blobs that are making your lines thicker than the other ones. Okay, all right, and that's it. So I'm gonna clean up my see that clean that up. Just wipe it off. Okay. Yeah, see these are, that blue is not dark enough, I don't think. 
it just doesn't maybe I should put white on there oh well yeah this is not gonna work let me go get some white and I will be right back okay I'm back so um now I have artist loft flow acrylic white which I'm gonna pour onto my trusty little handy dandy thing here let's see if this will work Yeah, see, since this paint, the blue paint isn't dry yet, it's mixing with the white, which may look okay, because it's a lot lighter color than that blue, but um, now let's see how this looks. <laughs> Okay, definitely I have all of the um, all of the lines filled in. Okay, get some more paper towel. And do, 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 do. Okay, what's that's a little bit better. I'm not gonna, um, these may just look better in black, um, the lines. Uh, what do y'all think? <laughs> Should I go for black? <laughs> this, you know what, this has not been my week. I had the editing issue, I had... Uh, just some other stuff, personal stuff happen, and all right, you know what? I think because of the the glitter in here, it's just throwing it all out of whack because if I put black on here it's gonna be just a little bit darker but not much so I'm gonna go ahead and stick with the blue the dark blue all right let's <laughs> I'm sorry guys this is just it just hasn't been my week okay so i'm just gonna clean my brush out and just try and get a lot of that white out of there i didn't bring my water in here with me as usual i'm always forgetting something Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and do this one over again. <laughs> I hope everybody's doing well, staying well. Protect yourself when you go out. I really feel my heart goes out to people that have loved, loved ones in the hospital or families that are having children and, you know, nobody can come see you when you're in the hospital. It's just terrible. Okay, so my lines are filled back up again. <laughs> I am definitely going to put this out of the way 
and this is my last paper towel, which is a good thing because this is my last attempt at the coaster. Oh, Lordy. Okay. Let's wipe this off. Shall we? Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely that that glitter in there is throwing off the whole color scheme. If it were just the the gold by itself, you know the the gold mica, then um, you know I'm gonna clean this off with my saliva. Cause I didn't bring my water with me and I don't want to get up and get it. Okay, that's good. Maybe. Okay. Sorry guys. Okay. Maybe y'all can do this without making so much without making so much of a mess. Okay. Meanwhile, my resin is sitting over here going, hello, I'm getting thicker. Okay, that's it. So let me grab a couple of cups because I'm going to need these. Okay, so the next step is I've got my resin all made up. Do, 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 do. Okay. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is, let's put the, whew, this stuff stinks. Okay. All right, what I'm going to do is pour a little bit in here, in here, on here, and I'm just going to take my finger and I'm going to spread it around the coaster. See there? You can see the difference. But, <laughs> unfortunately, so I've learned a lesson. I've learned so many lessons this week with video editing and I've got some new software I need to check out for the video editing um so anyway i'm not putting a really thick layer on here because all i'm doing is um just coating the top of it okay and that's it So I see a drip over here. I'm gonna catch that drip. Alrighty. Then I'm gonna set it here on my handy dandy cup. And some pour just a little bit. You really don't need that much. Just roll it around. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Okay. Alrighty then. Okay. These just, these don't look, I'm, I am so not happy with these. Um, if y'all want them, let me know. Uh, email me at indiabradyart at gmail.com and, um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna charge for something I don't like. 
Actually, this one came out lighter than this one. See the difference? This is how my week has gone. But it's been a while since I've uh, posted a video on YouTube. Um, and I really wanted to get these done. Um, I thought it's going to be short. I don't have to worry about the time. So, anyway. All right, now those are done all i have to do is just you know let them cure and i don't know what i'm gonna do with them i just they didn't turn out right so anyway um i'm gonna put you guys on pause and i will bring you in um and let you see the dominoes uh with its matching box okay see you in a sec Okay, so here they are. Yeah, I really think that they're really, they came out really well. And then I thought, oh, this is great. These are so pretty. And then I get over to here, which is the box. And I'll, I'll show you guys. You know, the box came out really nice. You know, that's the bottoms really pretty. Um, I put the dominoes in there so I could, you know, take pictures. And here's the top, I like the lid. Sorry about the glare. That's the top. That's the bottom. And it's, you know, it's really pretty, but You can't, it doesn't snap. It doesn't have any way of, you know. I mean, if you were to, if you were to pick it up, you know, you're going to have the top going all over the place. Oh, I just talk about, that was so disappointing. But anyway, um, if anybody wants a box, it's free. Just email me, I'll send you a box. Um, I, I ordered another mold, um, which I think will work. So, until next time, guys, um, I will check you later. See you next time.